Yes, guys, hope you guys are well. Listen, I'm going to show you on this video how to find niches or trending niches in Etsy um, so that you can get in there before they become really saturated. So I'm going to show you some tips on how to find those fantastic digital product niches really quickly using AI. So guys, if you do like videos like this, you do like videos on digital products and how to sell digital products online, then do hit the like, subscribe, smash the notification bell, um, guys, so you can get that video notification. Now, without further ado, let me show you something very quickly. Now, I'm on uh, ChatGPT, so any of you that obviously know about this, you'll know that this is an AI software that really can help you answer any question. So what I like to do is, I like to ask questions which are quite specific so that I can get really good answers that will help me sell or create digital products on uh, Etsy. So I've just opened up the, the chat for chat GPT and at the bottom here, I shall ask a question. So I'm gonna just simply say, what are, uh, what are the best trending digital, now look how specific I'm getting, products to sell on Etsy for a profit. I can't get any more specific than that, guys, right? Right, click enter. Let's see. Printable art, digital patterns, sewing, knitting, crochet patterns, SVG files, or vector graphics, digital planner templates. Uh, digital plans are getting printables for events and parties social media templates all right look at this guys this is giving me a list of six fantastic ones now don't forget um you know this this these answers are really good right so printable art digital patterns now there's something i've been you know interested in because whenever i ask chat gpt about this i do get a lot of this sewing or knitting patterns so i'm going to delve in a little bit deeper into this and i'm going to just go into uh, Etsy and then see if I can um, if I can uh, uh, find out if this is actually a really kind of good one to try out. So let me just go into Etsy very quickly and let me type in uh, sewing uh, patterns, all right? Digital, digital sewing patterns, right? There you go. Whoa, that's a lot of searches. Wait, so let me click that. Now, don't forget, I use uh, obviously my Everbe SEO software, uh, which is here. You can see it helps me with my product research and keyword research and so on and ranking. Um, so I'm gonna just, basically, I need to validate to see what if what chat GPT is saying is correct. So I wanna see if this really is a good one. Um, but yeah, so Everbe, you can try it out for free. The link is in my description with all the software I like to use for Etsy. Um, so yeah, check it out. Anyway, so digital sewing patterns is what we typed in. Let's just click enter very quickly. Now, there's actually a lot of search volume on this. So I need to kind of, I can get a little bit specific. So sometimes, you know, you can say, for example, digital sewing pattern for a dress, for example, okay, for dresses. Again, remember, you need to niche down even within the, if you like, the niche. You need to get a sub niche. Um, that way you can reduce the competition because look, if you see this, for example, guys, you can see I'm already on, sorry, let me just show you quickly. Um, if I did digital sewing patterns, you can see that the volume, the, res the, the results are 291,000, which is a huge, huge amount. So to come in in a listing, you know, fresh listing, it's very hard to rank. So hence why sometimes it's really good to niche down. So if I click digital sewing pattern for dresses, you'll see, hopefully, if I am correct, it should go down in terms of results. So look, the results are 13,000. So I can see myself ranking on this one because there's less competition. So what I would do is I would start looking at the product analytics and to see if, what are the profitable ones on this, what are the profitable listings on this uh, in, in this niche. So if I go to monthly revenue, I'm gonna just uh, change up uh, the, this is not bad actually. I didn't realize it was this good. So what you see is I want to go to this top one. 
and this one's making almost eight thousand dollars a month guys the listing's only been up for one month they haven't been there for long and if i click this uh if i click the product let's just have a look at a little bit into this it's very interesting for me guys because look we just found a really good one and what it is is a dress digital pdf sewing pattern and um, it's making almost eight thousand dollars guys for this one listing um so yeah you know and these are all the tags you can see actually there's a lot of volume in this i didn't realize look sewing pattern actually has 3728 as a volume people searching for it so this is this sh this is see chat gpt is true it's right um it's showing me that this is something that can be that can be done right so i want to just look at this listing just get into this listing a little bit more view it on etsy so this one, guys, is making almost eight thousand dollars a month, right? This just this one listing, and all it is is a uh, a dress pattern. Uh, let me just quickly go into it. Just nice image to show you what the what the dress would look like once it's produced. Um, yeah, and then various options and so on. And all it is, guys, is a it's a digital pattern, and you can download download it. You've got five PDFs there, so. Um, yeah that is one way look at this i've literally just found a gem guys a gem using chat gpt and then what i would do is literally i would go down the list and see what else they've said and then validate it so what i did was i just highlighted sewing pattern uh, knitting pa knitting pattern is another one so this is actually something slightly different so i might go back and then i'll try and validate and see if chat gpt um and uh has said uh, something else now what's great is i use my seo software ever be just to validate make sure everything is correct but let me just go to um, knitting this is going to be slightly different obviously but i want to see how knitting is because i'll be honest i haven't looked at these niches really um but you know like i said chat gpt is giving me some really good ideas digital knitting patterns guys let's just type that in you know forty two thousand. okay slightly above where i want to be but again remember what i said we can sometimes niche down and go down to maybe being more specific it might be a digital knitting pattern for a jumper or, or a blanket so that's how we, we we go down but let me just actually go to product analytics right now even with this volume and let me see if there's some good money to be made in in this particular niche because this is going to be interesting let's see Okay, so we got this listing here, which is uh, a knitting. Actually, no, we got this listing here, which is a knitting pattern, which is making one thousand six hundred fifty-eight. Not too bad, and it's for a little. What is that for? A little frog, <laughs> a froggy, <laughs> froggy sweater. That is mad. Look. So if I click on the uh, go to the view Etsy, this is like making. Look at that. It's a little uh, knitted sweater right froggy sweater it's called let me click ever be just to check out exactly how much it's making you know this is making 1658 monthly revenue not too bad guys right and then i get to see what the the look it's actually got people are actually typing in frog knitting and there's a volume of 301 and it's actually trending guys look it's actually going up knitted frog 301 is actually going up so some of these look sweater pattern. This is an, a trending niche. Look at it, sweater pattern two hundred two thousand five hundred ninety eight going up. So if you created a sweater pattern, that's a good one to do as well because it's a it's a sort of trending niche. Yeah. So guys, this is how you'd find trending niches, niches that are, that you can actually make some really good passive income and actually markets that you can get into the digital product world before they become too saturated. Because guys, sometimes when you're coming into something and you see so many listings, then it get, it's almost like it's a little bit late to get into. However, using ChatGPT, you are able to find, you know, profitable. And if you're asking a question, be specific. When I asked it, what are the best trending digital products to sell on Etsy for a profit? It actually gave me those. Now, what I'll do is I'll just go down the list of all of these and just try to find sub niches. Because remember what I what we did, we found a sub niche. So within the knitting, sorry, the sewing niche, we found dresses and that's a sub niche. So guys, find sub niches within the overall kind of idea product um, and then find those gems, guys. 
and use ChatGPT. Use AI to help you guys. Guys, if you do like to find trending videos or all, all kinds of videos on digital products, how to sell digital products, how to produce digital products, please hit the like, subscribe, smash the notification bell. And don't forget to check out my two videos at the top. Don't forget to check out my playlist and all the links in my description where I show you all the software that I use. Guys, take care and I shall see you on the next one.